Four things, right? These four things: knowing, assuming, and based on this assumption, we are doing some thinking. And based on this thinking, we are doing some doing. Yeah. So we assume ourselves to be body. these two things we are seeing these two things as effect of all of these things for absence of this some assumptions without knowing without knowing the reality what we have seen is that or what the proposal is that the reality is what that human being is coexistence of self and body If we can see it for ourselves, then it is true for us. If we cannot see it for ourselves, we have some assumption about. So we'll 
make a program accordingly. So all this has to do with the program. This has to be. This has to do with what you know the reality is. And this reality we can see for ourselves only if we have exploded ourselves. If we have only assume something. We are doing this. It may be right, may not be right. That is why we can't. Like those two things that Ganeshi mentioned. That if we have not seen things for ourselves, then two things happen. One is our own confidence about is it really so or not. That is why when somebody else gives some other proposal, then you say, yeah, yeah, that might also be right. That is one thing, our own confidence. And the second thing is that we are not able to transfer this to the next generation authentically. We are only able to pass it on as do's and don'ts. This is our this is how things are done. So, those and don'ts, they don't work. So, those and don'ts don't really work. In the absence of this, we are doing all these things. If we find out what is the reality, for example, the proposal is that human being is equal to self and coexistence of self and body. If you can see this, then our assumption about what is human being, what is the need for human being, what is the way to fulfill that, etc., that will change. Whereas if I have assumed I am body, that I will be thinking about what? If I see my art process, what did you see in this video? What is this man thinking about? This is over evaluated. This material is over evaluated. It's not that it is not required, it is significantly over evaluated. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, and that is coming from the consumer side. I want this new you know, desktop or whatever, all that. And the business is also working towards that because that's what the demand is. If the demand was to do with something else. Suppose it became to do with this, then we'll start thinking about this. So this is this a route for my happiness? Is conversing with people something that results in my happiness? Or is it eating ice cream only deals with happiness or whatever it is? So we have to see. So, as far as the business is concerned, it is thinking of more profit and it doesn't matter whether a little bit of toxic material is used, it's okay, little bit of garbage is created, that is okay, mm -hmm. we'll give some employment to people, etc. Dispose of the garbage, all that. Yeah. What else did you observe? Um, I could be wrong, but 
rather than debate. I am right, you are wrong. I have to win. <laughs> then we will have to discuss. Discussion means I know something about this program. You also know something about the program. And we can decide, we can discuss it and come to some you know, conclusion about it. what we are doing is getting influenced because we are not authentic ourselves. We have to see. And that is happening to a lot of societies. Because this is not very clear. Because we have not seen things for ourselves. We have made a lot of assumptions. Many of the assumptions are right. And many of the assumptions are not right. So we have to see the ones that are right. So, yeah. We can see that consumerism and all that our way. But it is up to us whether we take it or we don't take it. It is up to us to be able to, to live with that responsibility. That if somebody is living like that, my neighbor is living like that, then if I know what is right, then I can share it with him also. So it's not the case that somebody is trying to make things you know, go in a wrong direction. Because there is that assumption that that is the right thing to do, that profit is the right thing to do, or, you know, I am body, so sensation is very important for me. All these sensations, this, all this is important for me. That is, you can see all the sensations that are there. That's sound in uh, sight, smell, and taste. That this is very important for me. So my whole program for happiness revolves around all this. What was being discussed is that these things, physical things, this is important for me. This sensation I can derive from these things. But I can also derive some sensation from expression of things like this. From the other. Yeah? Our whole program is for name and fame. Yeah? So we'll get that. When we get that name and fame, we will, from outside, we will feel good. You can just switch this off. This switch this off. This one is switch it <laughs> you can take off this, this cable. This cable. Mm -hmm. so we have made a program like this. We are thinking about this. We have assumed I am body. Mm -hmm. And my program is essentially going to be based on sensation or physical facility. And if I see my thinking, I will be all the time thinking about such things. I asked one of my uh, friend's daughter, she is working for uh, one of these big companies, she is HR head or something. I asked her, in a day, how much time you eat food, cook food, clean the dishes, and think about food. And she said 60%. A lot of times, take the total time in all these activities. Cooking the food, eating the food, cleaning and all that, and 
thinking about food. Time is spent on that. That is nothing but this <coughs> coming from here. So physical facility becomes very important. And that's what the program essentially boils down to accumulation of physical facility. Variety and all that. What else did you observe in the video? for if there is a problem you know, to find a solution for it. You can find out what the problem is and look for solution. You don't want to continue the problem. And one solution is, a part of the solution is to make the process cyclic. It's a very important part. Yes. And she said that you know, the system didn't make itself. People made the system. We are also people. We can make a new system. Over a period of time, we can find out what is the right system, make it. That's what she is saying. And all the green chemistry, etc. People are working. That is part of the solution, of course. But nobody wants to live with you know, these problems. So what is, you know, over here, what we are sort of seeing is that we are looking at problems. Then we are trying to find solutions for it. Okay? And what we see is that is this enough? Is this much enough? Like for example, because somebody else is like you know, somebody said lost control of her mind. That Somebody else is telling us what to do. So for centuries we were eating corn and maize and jowar and bajra and all these the grains. Now it is more fashionable to eat rice and wheat. And it takes so much water to grow this rice. It takes a lot of water to grow grow rice. It? Whereas it doesn't take so much water to grow maize, for example. Because we are now being preconditioned that, you know, the right thing to eat is uh, rice. We are all starting to eat rice. Yeah? So, that is creating a problem. Now we are looking for how to get more water. So, we are taking more deeper, you know, drawing water from the ground. In India, the water table is going down very rapidly. Where I am living in Hyderabad, the water used to be at 10 feet, 20 feet, like that, you know, certainly less than 100 feet. Now, they are digging bore wells for 600 feet. So, it's, so, we have 
created the problem. I want some solution for it. Eat rice. Now we are taking two or three crops of rice in that area. Water table is going down. Now we are digging, going to technology for better roof pump. <coughs> what do you think? That is solution or that is aggravating the problem? <laughs> yeah? All that. So, what we need to look at is that we are actually not looking at the problem also. We are only looking at the symptoms. And this solution is also, is it real solution or is it just a temporary solution or temporary suppression of symptoms? It's really not not solution. What do you think? This eating rice is it naturally acceptable, or is it because you know lot of media and other people are saying you know the rich people eat rice, the developed people eat rice. <laughs> so he said yes, yes, that is good. We also should eat rice. Where I am, there we have this packaged wheat flour, Ashirvad. And it said that we have put this uh, vitamin and this and that in that, so you should eat this. So people go and buy it. Whereas earlier we used to get these grain, wash it, dry it, then grind it and eat it. Now, that, now it is. So preconditioning is setting, you know, like we are saying, losing control of the mind. Yes. We are not deciding ourselves. Somebody else is deciding. And what is the focus of it? Is it for nurturing this white, this rice, or white rice, even worse, it used to be that unpolished rice before. Now it is white rice because it looks good. Like uh, you were saying about the you know, appearance has to appear good white rice versus the brown rice. Polished rice versus the polished rice versus the unpolished rice. So essentially what is happening is that we are because we are working on the symptom which we don't like, we want to get rid of it. And we are working towards more or less suppression of symptom. Whereas if we look at things as they are then we will be able to see that there is all encompassing solution based on reality. And human being is coexistence of self and body is only one part of it, but know all of that put together based on reality some on all encompassing solution then we will make effort for that for this solution and if there is a problem then we will try to find the solution for that problem if at all there is a problem this will be doing continuously. And this will do as and when there is a problem. If there is a problem. Then we'll find a solution. If there are a lot of problems now, we still have to find solution for those. But you can find out what the real problem is only in the light of you know the reality as it is. For example, if I am able to see this, I am self and body, then I can correct my program. That this self has a need called happiness. 
and this happiness is only fulfilled by right understanding.